Okay, check it out. Uh, I just wanted to make sure you can see what's going on. I also wanted to show you um, how I think you can get the best sounds out of this thing. Um, right now, so it's got a, uh, it's got an input for 15 watts or, uh, or one watt. I never used the, the one watt. Um, I just didn't really use it. Uh, but whatever, into the 15, I find that like pretty much, you know, you can set this thing like at 12 o'clock. And what I've found is if you're into clean tones, you're gonna wanna like max out the volume here and uh, use the gain to draw to, to bring up find your find your volume it'll start breaking up like amps will use is they'll just uh, max out the volume and then use the gain as like a master volume you can you can dial this back obviously but you know if you're jamming with your buddies and you're going for like a clean tone that's that's how i would set it up use that to find where the starts breaking up of course you can use your uh, your guitar's volume uh, control to kind of clean it back up again of course I'm playing SG right now in uh, with humbuckers but I can split it so you can hear what single coil sound like. So that's with the volume dialed back. Of course you can roll up the volume on your guitar. Start getting those. Anyways, it's an awesome sounding amp. Um, like I said, I just gotta make space. I got too much gear. Another thing you may want to consider, uh, something I did with this amp for a while was in valve one, if you want sort of more, more clean headroom, you can always put a, uh, you can always put a 12 AU7 in valve one. And what that'll do is like, sort of, if you're into more like, like that breaks up, you know, at about halfway, it's breaking up pretty hard. With a 12AU7, you know, it'll start breaking up like, you know, at around seven or eight, like pretty, pretty, pretty well, you know what I mean? So it'll give you a little bit more, a little bit more of a sweep between that clean to break up sound. It gives you a bit more control, I've found. But at the same time, it won't push your power tubes as hard. Um, so if you're looking for volume, like, uh, you know, leaving it with a 12, 12 AX7 in the, in the valve one is perfectly, uh, perfectly, you know, that's what it was designed to do. It's just an option I wanted you to be aware of. Uh, last thing is I just installed, uh, a match set of, uh, of JJ EL84s in it for you just because I don't have any more amps that have EL84s in it anymore. So I thought I'd pass that along. Anyways, I hope you enjoy. Bye.